بِاسْمِ رَبِّكَ الَّذِي Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome back to another episode of Ramadan time. It is another day of Ramadan and I hope everybody is doing well. Alhamdulillah, I am fine. Being kind to animals is a very important thing. Not only should we be kind to animals, but we should be kind to everyone. Do you remember the story of the woman who fed a thirsty dog? Do you recall how Allah forgave her sins? Subhanallah, we should be just like her and inshallah we will. When I say this, I mean that whenever we see an animal in need of help, then we should always help them. Now, let's move on to the good deed of the day. Consider finding Islamic charities that list families and children to send Eid cards to. It will certainly put a smile on their face. Now let's move on to Hadith. And Abi Huraira radiallahu anhu qala, qala Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, inna allaha la yanzuru ila ajsadikum wa la ila suwarikum wa lakin yanzuru ila qulubikum wa a'malikum. It is reported on the authority of Abu Hurairah anhu that he said, Allah's Messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, Verily, Allah does not look at your bodies nor your appearance, but rather he looks at your heart and your deeds. So, Samiha, it doesn't matter if you look amazing and if you don't, if you don't do any good deeds but, you, but you're very, very good looking, then Allah's not going to be happy. However, no matter how you look or no matter how your appearance is, if you have lots of good deeds and you always pray salah on time, um, read the Quran and do, <laughs> and do as much ibadat as you can and you have a good character, hmm. then Allah will be happy with you. Okay. Now let's move on to the lessons of this hadith. Number one, our physical appearance is not important to Allah. N- number two, what is important to Allah is what is in our hearts and what deeds we do. Now let's move on to the discussion section. So Samiha, I'm going to ask you a few questions, okay? Mm-hmm. Number one, what is important to Allah? Important to Allah. Yeah, what is important to Allah? Um... Let's help her. No. Um, the thing that's important to Allah is what is in our hearts and the deeds that we do. Okay. Number two. If a person is good looking, has a big house and a rich family, but his heart is full of bad thoughts and he does not do any good deeds, will Allah be happy with him? Yes, because he doesn't do good it's deeds. True. <laughs> it's not a true or false question, but Allah will not be happy with him because he doesn't do any good deeds and his heart is full of bad thoughts. Mm-hmm. Number three, how can we increase Allah's love for us? Um, His love for us. What, sh- um, what should we do to we, make Allah love us more? We should tidy up more. <laughs> no, we should yeah. do lots of good deeds. <laughs> no, to make your parents happy, then you can tidy up. But to make Allah happy, you could do lots of good deeds and have good intention and have a good heart. Okay. Now that we finished hadith, let's move on to Surah Learning Time. So we're going to move on to a new surah, Surah Al Qari'ah. Now repeat after me. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم القارعة القارعة ما القارعة ما القارعة وما أدراك ما القارعة وما أدراك ما القارعة يوم يكون الناس كالفراش المبثوث يوم يكون الناس كالفراش المبثوث 
وتكون الجبال كالإحن المنفوش وتكون الجبال كالإحن المنفوش <تصفيق> فأما من ثقلت موازينه فأما فأما من خفت <تصفيق> فأما من ثقلت موازينه فأما من ما فكو yeah. فكلت موازينه فهو في عيشة راضية فهو في عيشة راضية وأما من خفت موازينه وأما 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 خفت موازينه فأمه هاوية فأمه هاوية وما أدراك ما هي وما أدراك ما هي نار هامية نار هامية Okay, now we're not going to say it again because Sumi is very, very tired. So she's going to learn it instead. Then tomorrow she's going to say it by herself. Assalamu alaikum, everyone. See you tomorrow, inshallah. <laughs> Bismillahirrahmanirrahim.